What's up, boy, TPC? This is DSG Pipe Smoker with another pipe smoking video. Doing a video on the porch because there's not really a whole lot of wind. And I'm smoking my Dording Freehand Signature Pipe. With some Captain Earl's Honor Blend. Doing a VR to Max. Defiant Pipes. Who's doing a contest. For his uh, celebration of being on YouTube. Or at least being a content creator for a year. And to enter his contest. You gotta give... Uh, three pieces of life advice that he can pass on to his son. Now, before I begin, understand this. Actually, a couple of things. First of all, I am 27 years old. Soon to be 28. I'm still trying to figure stuff out myself. But what I've learned so far, there are, are a few things I feel like I can pass down to somebody half my age, we'll say. And secondly, I want to give advice that cannot be easily looked up on the internet because the newer generations, starting with the Millennials, they're getting very, um, they're getting very good with technology, and they're, they're getting better at looking things up on their own. Um, now, whether or not they're willing to look it up on their own is definitely debatable, um, but I still want to avoid giving advice that can be easily looked up. Granted, again, they're going to have to be willing to look it up and not look up things like, you know, playthroughs for video games or let's plays for video games. Perfectly fine, but I feel like the younger generations and the generations that are coming up, when something goes wrong, they're going to want to look something up anyways. And even if they primarily use the internet just for entertainment and amusement. So these are three pieces of life advice that... I don't think they're necessarily going to look up on the internet. Or if they... Um, if they do decide to look it up, I think they're going to get a hunch. At least the first part. The first piece of advice that I have. They're going to get a hunch that... You know, they should have listened to this advice. But with that out of the way, let me tell you what my three pieces of advice are. Advice number one. Always have spare or at least, or preferably two or three spares of keys for your vehicle and your car. I don't know about where Max lives, but up here, it is dangerous to be stranded out of your car or out of your house without spare keys because you can't get in. No, it has nothing to do with moose um, or bears or anything like that. I suppose in rural Alaska that might be an issue, but up here it's weather. Hypothermia is a big, big concern, um, especially when you consider that two-thirds, three-fourths of the year, um, it's not exactly summer weather, so. Based off of my own personal experience, I'm going to recommend getting a sp at least one, if not two, spare sets of keys for your vehicle and for your house. It's just a good thing to have. Advice number two. Always have a plan B. Now, this is true for a lot of things. 
whether you're picking a career to do um, and you're really passionate about something, still you sh should still have a plan B because it might not work out. You know, I went to college to be a strength and conditioning coach. I'm a locksmith because that didn't end up working out. Um, you know, you could... It could be something simpler than that. You could be... You could decide to go one direction on a road, and it's the path you've always chosen, but, you know, it might not be a bad idea to learn the routes in your neighborhood, or in your town, or even your state, so you can have backup routes. In case the road is blocked. Construction, um, protests, natural disasters, things like that. So always have a plan B. And last, but certainly not least, my third piece of advice is to never stop learning. You are never too old, you are never too wise, never too smart, never too clever, never too experienced to still learn things. My stepdad's been working on locks for 30 years, and we still come across locks every day that we've never seen before. Well, I wouldn't say every day, maybe once or twice a week, but still, it happens. And, you know, that's, that's true for a lot of things. And I know a lot of people are going to use, you know, the, the advice, well, you know, you're young, you don't know as much as um, you think you do, you might think you know everything, but you don't. I'm going to further solidify this with my second favorite quote, uh, my second favorite movie quote, that is, which I think, although the specifics might be you know, a little iffy, the overall message, I think, really, really hits home with this third and final piece of advice. 1,500 years ago, everybody knew that the Earth was the center of the universe. 500 years ago, everybody knew that the Earth was flat. And 15 minutes ago, you thought you were the only... You thought that we were alone on this planet. Imagine what you will know tomorrow. That is a quote from the original Men in Black movie that came out in 97, I think? 98, somewhere in there? And it was spoken by Agent K to Agent J. So, Max, those are my three pieces of advice. And for the rest of you, this has been DSG Pipe Smoker with another pipe smoking video. You guys have a great day.